Welcome to Kendra's Artistic Crochet Designs. And today we are going to be making um, these jack-o'-lanterns next. Um, we did the ghost, the spider, and now the jack-o'-lanterns um, on our Halloween shawl, mosaic shawl. So let's get to it. Okay, now we're down on the table. Um, so right after the spiders, we had to put four rows of single crochets in, which we did right there, though they are. And now we're going to start this row by putting the orange on. So we're going to be going across uh, with orange and purple this time. Um, so in the first row, as we always do in the first one, in the back loop only, we're putting two single crochets in there. And then we're just going to single crochet all the way across. Getting ready for our jack-o'-lanterns. So I'm going to finish crocheting mine all the way across. Oh, and um, I counted we have 112 stitches across there. So you should have a hundred um, 114 by the time you're done with this row. You should have 114 stitches. I will see you at the end of this row. So at the end of that row, make sure that you're putting two stitches in that last stitch too. So you should have 114, like I said. Um, now we're going to go back to the purple. And we're going to do a standing standing uh, single crochet in that first single crochet. And now we need a double down here. We got to go down here and find this first stitch. And this stitch is really hard to find. But it's there. That's the one that you need. And if you don't make if you don't make those first stitches a little bit looser, then you're gonna go through that. <laughs> I guess. Alright, so what we are doing now is we're putting ten um double we need ten double crochets. So there's three. Four five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so now we need 11 single crochets. So there's two, th three, I think I split my yarn. Let's try that again. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, we've got eleven singles. And now we need, um, 17 doubles. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 
13, 14, 15, 16, 17. All right, so I'm just going to do this row with you. So now we need 11 singles. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And now 17 doubles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Now 11 singles, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, okay, 17 doubles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and now 11 uh, singles. There's 2, 3, 4, 5, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And let's see how many we've got left. We should have about ten. So there's one, two, three. These are doubles, by the way. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then this single up here is ten. So, yep, we ended up with ten stitches. All right. And then now we're going to cut it off. And so that will give us four pumpkins across there. That is the start of our pumpkins. All right. So here is the end. Uh, this will end row one. And with the orange, we're going to put a standing single in the first stitch. 
and also another stitch in there. All right. And now we're going to single crochet. Uh, that's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So you should have twelve singles. And now we're going to double. And these orange ones down here. Come on. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Wait a minute. Did I? I started in the wrong one. That one is half. Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness. Now there's one, two. There should be 11. Three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, and then you should have seventeen singles. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. So here is your repeat. You will start here and do 11 doubles and 17 singles in between the pumpkins and making sure on your pumpkins you're making 11 doubles. Um, and then um, at the end, I will tell you what we have at the end. What I'll meet you there. Okay. Okay, so at the end of... Um, that orange row, you're going to have 12 because you're putting two in that last one. So you're going to, or is it 11? It's 11, I'm sorry. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, it's a 11, not 12. <laughs> sorry. All right. So that means that we finished row one. Okay. So now we're going to go to row two. And it looks like 12, 13, there's 15 in that row. All right, so we're going back to the purple. Get ready for row two. And we are going to do a standing single and then we're going to find our first stitch down here and start doing our double crochets to cover up these orange stitches um, do that correctly so there's two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. All right, so now, well, wait a minute, that ain't right. <laughs> Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine double crochets, and now we need, because we need 15 singles. So there's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Okay, and then here's we need the doubles. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen doubles. And here is your repeat then. You're going to do 15 singles and 13 doubles. All the way across. We'll do the other three pumpkins and then I'll meet you at the end. Okay, so we ended up with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then eight double crochets in that one single at the end. All right, let's cut this off and go back to our orange to finish off row two of our jack-o'-lantern. Okay, so we have uh, to do a standing single and put another one in that same stitch. All right, now we have three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven singles. And now we've got doubles to do. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 doubles for the pumpkin. And now we got to go back to our singles. And that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen singles. So here is your, we need fifteen doubles and thirteen singles all the way across. 
So your pumpkins are 13 doubles, and then in between the pumpkins we need 13 singles. So I will see you at the end of this row. Okay, so um, we ended this row with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 8, 9, 10, 11. Is that 10? Wait a minute. 1, 2, 3, 4, 8, 9, 10. Okay, 10. Because we put 2 at the end. 2 single crochets on the end there. Um, so that ended row 2. Row 2 is done. Moving right along, we need our purple again, or whatever color that you're using in your background. All right. So we are going to start out again using a standing single in the back loop of the first single and we need to start our doubles again so we can cover up these orange ones so there is one two three four five six seven, eight, nine. So there's nine doubles and now we need uh, 17 singles. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. And let's see how many doubles we've got. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So eleven doubles. 17, so here's a repeat, 17 singles, 11 doubles, all the way across, and I will catch you at the end. Okay, so we ended the row with 8 double crochets and 1 single. And now let's get our orange and finish up row 3. Okay, so we are going to start out with a standing a single and put another one in there. And that's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And now we need our doubles. So, and that will be 17. So there's two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, 
10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Okay, we got to go to our singles. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So here's your repeat. Seventeen doubles, eleven singles, all the way across. And I'll see you at the end. Okay, so here's the end of it. We just need some single crochets here. I finished that last pumpkin. So there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, because we're putting two in that last one. And then we're going to cut this off. And there you go. The pumpkins seem a lot, whenever I was doing my other one, seem a lot easier. They seem, it seemed a lot easier to do the pumpkins. So, those spiders though. Anyway, they were, they were a little bit harder. So anyway, we just, we just finished row three. Okay, so we've got three rows of the pumpkins done. And we need row four next. Row four, we're going to start in with the mouth, okay? Which means I am going to need the yellow, the gold, or the yellow. So we'll get that out. And what we need to do with this yellow is we are going to, we're going to make a, um, a little ball. We need four of them because we have four pumpkins. And instead of dragging yellow all the way across, so I'm just saying we're just going to do a little ball like this. Just like that. And we're going to cut it off. Okay, you see that? So you're going to make four of those. And I don't think we need these quite yet, but we will need them um, when we put the orange in. So there's one or two <laughs> we have four pumpkins so we need four little balls to do this should be enough yarn to do the the mouth and the eyes and the nose so it should be enough yarn to do that So there's four of those ready to go. And now we're going to go with the purple again. I need to get our purple yarn out. And so we're going to do, first of all, let's get started in here. And with the purple, we're going to do a standing single, and then we're going to start our doubles. Let's see. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. And so now we need we need seven. So we're going to do seven singles. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then we're going to, we're going to need to keep four. We need four for the mouth. So there's one, two, three, four. And then seven. So we're actually single crocheting all the way across. <laughs> Three. So you're actually single crocheting all the way across. Yeah, it was supposed to, it's seven. And why do I think I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's only there's eight. Oh, that's well. Okay. I didn't do that right. All right. Now I know what we did. We need to come one out on each side of the pumpkin, too. So I'm glad I looked at that. So now you take one of those, do those double crochets out because we need to put a single in that instead. So there's two, three four, five, six, seven, and then one, two, three, four, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight on the other side of that mouth. Okay, now let's do our doubles. Um, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine. So I think it's nineteen all together. Yep. Okay, so here's your repeat. 19 singles on your pumpkin and 10. Was it 10? One, two, three, six, seven, eight. No, nine. Nine doubles all the way across. So we've got 19 singles and 
nine doubles in between the pumpkins. And I will catch you at the end of the row. Okay, so here we are at the end, and I just finished the last pumpkin. And now we need to put in our double crochets. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then one single crochet, which will make nine. And we'll cut that off. And the purple part is done. Now we need to finish off row four by putting the orange on. And we are also going to put in the yellow ones, so you'll see what I do. Okay. All right. So let's start off by using a standing um, single and then put another one in there. And now we need, there's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And now we need six. I mean seven double, so there's one, two, three, four, five, six, and this is seven, and we're only going to do half of it, and then we're going to take one of these yellow ones. And we're going to finish off that double crochet. So then I'm going to use these. We need four with the yellow, right? We need four. One, two, three, Four. And what I did is I just, I took this orange along with me, under there, as you saw that. Um, but I, we need to do half of, half, and then this yellow can go in the back, and we could sew that in later. And now um, this orange we're going to bring back up and then we'll put that yellow in the back. Okay, now with the orange, we're going to finish this, this off. This, so we need eight. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, I'm going to be careful with this yarn getting mixed up. So this is, this is going to stay on the table for the next time we go across there. Um, I'm going to go over another pumpkin with you. So you can see exactly what I did, because now I feel like I went too fast on that pumpkin. So um, here we got, um, there is one single, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine singles in between the pumpkins. Now, we're going to start another pumpkin. Okay? And we're going to start out with seven doubles. So there's one, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven. Now we're only going to do half of it because we're going to start another one of these balls of yarn. And I'm going to pull this in, pull, pull this, and so now we need four, right? And see these two yarns right here? I'm just going to cover those as I'm going to double crochet. I'm double crocheting them in. So there's one, two, three, and four. So I'm, I'm bringing that orange along with me. We can sew that in later. I brought the orange with me because we need to change back to the orange to finish the pumpkin. So there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we have eight doubles to finish that off. And then you'll do your nine, I think it was nine singles. Yeah, nine singles and then finish off the other two pumpkins. And then um, just in the way I finished those other two. So you'll finish off your other two pumpkins and I'll meet you at the end. All right, so we um, ended this row with nine single crochets, and that's adding the um, one at the end. All right, so here, here we are. We started the mouth of the pumpkins, of the jack-o'-lanterns. I keep saying pumpkins, but they're jack-o'-lanterns. And that ends row four. So row four is done. So now we're going to do row five. Yeah, let's do row five. Um, we are going back to our purple again. Row five is the same amount as the last one. So we're not adding to our pumpkin, we're just adding to the mouth later on, not this row. Next row. All right, so let's start out with a standing single and another, nope. And now we have to do our doubles because we've got to cover up these orange orange ones here. So there's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So now we have uh, 10 doubles and we are going to start our singles and we're going to, we're just going to single crochet in all 17 of those or 19 actually. So it's, uh, so we got 19 single crochets that we need to do. There's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight,
12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. And now we need it doubles. So there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So here's a repeat. 19 singles and 9 doubles all the way across and I will catch you at the end. Okay, so I finished the last pumpkin and we need to put in the rest of the, the last of the doubles. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And we're, we're doing a single there in the end. Cut that off and go back to our orange to finish up row five. So we're going to start with the standing single and then add another single to it. And then we're here's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Let me see. Yeah, 12. All right. So there's 12 singles there. And we need um, six, six doubles. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six. And we are, I'm only doing half of one because I need to bring up this yellow from the back. But I'm going to carry my orange with me. And in this next one, right here, we're going to we're going to make sure we carry the orange. I'm going to put, we need one in there. And then go back to the orange. And now we need four orange. So, and I'm also going to carry that yellow with me because I need that yellow on the other side. So there's one, two, three, four, do half, go back to the yellow, and the next stitch, I'm carrying that orange with me, we're going to do yellow, but we're going to go back to the orange. And you just pull it. Now, we're going to let that yellow fall back behind, and we need seven uh, orange. So there's one, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven. And that finishes up the pumpkin. So we've got the yellow on each side of the the bottom part of that mouth. Um, now we need a single. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine singles. So here's your repeat, okay? Your repeat is seven doubles, one yellow, yet double. So seven orange doubles, one yellow double, and four orange doubles, one yellow double, and seven orange doubles. This is six. I'm sorry. This was six, one, four, one, seven, and then what was that? Nine um, singles. Yeah, nine singles. So that is your repeat and do that all the way across. Okay, so we we need, I just finished the last uh, jack-o'-lantern and we need singles in these last ones. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then I need two in this last one to make 11. There's 10 and 11. And we are done. Now, I'm, we're going to cut this off. And um, we just finished five, row five. And now row six. But it looks like we're coming out again on each side of the pumpkin um, to create 21 stitches. So let's get our purple out. start with a standing single and then we're going to start our doubles. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So now we have ten, and now we need twenty-one singles. So there is one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, whoa, how did I lose that? Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. And let's see how many doubles we need then. 
So there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so we have, um, here is the repeat, 21 singles and seven doubles. And you're going to do that all the way across, and I will catch you at the end. Okay, so we're at the end. I've finished up my last jack-o'-lantern, and we need to put some doubles in here. So here is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and there's nine doubles, and then we're going to put a single in the last one here, and then cut her off. So now we need to finish this row by adding the orange in. Okay, so here we go with the orange. We're going to start with the standing single. And we need to put another one in that first one as well, too. So there's two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So we have twelve singles, and now we need to start our doubles. And so we are doing row six, and we are going to need six doubles. There's one, two, three, four, five, and six. And now we're going to, I just did half of a stitch. I need to find the yellow one back here <laughs> and bring that across. And now we need need to make a yellow double. So there's one, but we don't want to finish that because I need I need the orange black. But we're going to um, I'm going to travel the yellow underneath the orange. So I need six oranges to go across there six orange doubles so there's one two three four five and six and now we're not going to finish that because we need to bring that yellow back up here And now we need to make a yellow one, which I'm going to carry this orange over here. And then go back to the orange. Alright, and now we need to finish 
on the other side. We need seven doubles on the other side of this mouth. So there's two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And now we need singles. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven singles. All right, so we need six doubles of orange. This is your repeat. Six doubles of orange, one yellow. Six doubles of orange, one yellow. Seven doubles of orange, and six. One, two, three, four, six. Seven singles. And you're going to do that all the way across. And I'll see you at the end. All right, so I finished the last jack-o'-lantern, and let's see how many we need how many single crochets we need. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then we have 10 and 11. And then we're done. with row six. Okay, so this is row seven. Row seven. We need to go back to the purple again. And in the purple, row 7 is the exact same as row 6 was in the purple. So, we're going to start with a standing single. And then we're going to go with our double. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Uh, doubles and now we need singles and we're going to do 21 singles so there's two three four five six seven eight nine 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, and 21. 21 singles and One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So our repeat is 21 singles and seven doubles. And you're going to go all the way across like that. And I'll see you at the end. 
Okay, so we're at the end of the row and we need some doubles in here. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then we need a single at the end. And we could cut it off. That's the end of the purple row. Now let's finish the row with the orange. We're finishing up row seven. And we're going to start with the standing single and the first one and put another one in there. So there's two three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen. All right. So, we are at row 7, and I, well, I'm going to need 5 doubles of orange. So there's 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, and we're just going to do half so we can bring this yellow up here, but wait a minute, I need this orange to be in the front. There we go. Bring the yellow across. And then we need to make a yellow one. In the wrong one, I, put, I made it in the wrong one. <laughs> oh goodness. The yellow one goes here. All right. And then we're going back to the orange. And we need eight oranges across there. So there's, um, but we should, we need to bring that yellow across with us. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Make a half, bring the orange in the front and come into the with the yellow. And then the next one, we're going to put a yellow one. And then now we need um, six uh, orange to finish it. So there's one, two, three, four, five. Six, and now I need some singles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so here's your repeat. You need six doubles of orange and then one yellow double eight orange doubles, one yellow double, six orange doubles, and seven, 
seven singles. And you're going to do that all the way across, and I'll catch you at the end. Okay, so now we, um, I've finished my last um, jack-o'-lantern, and we need to put single crochets in here. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And we are finished with this round. So round seven is finished. And then we will start round eight next. Okay, so we have, um, we finished seven, now we're going to do eight. And now we need our purple yarn again to start row eight. We're going to do two rows the same. So we are going to start with a standing single in the first one and then we have to make start making our double crochets. So that's one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Twelve, and now we need to do twenty one single crochets. Starting here, so there's one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 18, 19, 20, and 21. And now we go back to the double for in between the pumpkins or the jack o' lanterns. So there's two, three, four, five, six. Seven. So that is that we've you you're um you're gonna start with twenty one and then seven. Twenty one and seven the rest of the way across. And I will meet you at the end of the row. Okay, so I just finished my last jack o' lantern and these uh we need double crochets here at the end here. So there's one two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and this is eleven. And then a single crochet at the top. And we'll cut that off. And now we go to the orange to finish up row eight. So here is a standing single, and then we're going to put another one in there, and that's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14. And now we're just going to put 21 double crochets across here. And there's four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. All right, now we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, six, seven. So your repeat is 21 double crochets and seven singles until you get to the end. Now, um, we're going to let you finish up this row and then um, also on your own, you're going to do another row of purple and another row of uh, orange so that we have rows eight and nine done. And it is the exact same. So so both rows are the exact same except for it always we always add on the ends. The the number ain't going to be the same on the ends because um when we do the orange we always add one more to it. So um that's the only thing that is going to be different, but I think you can handle that and we will be back for row 10. Okay, so your jack-o'-lanterns should look like this. We just did rows um, 8 and 9. And we are going to start with row 10. Which we need the purple yarn again. And 10 is actually going to be the same as 8 and 9 in the purple yarn. But in the orange, we're going to be doing the, the pumpkin nose in row 10. So, so row actually, row 10 of the purple is the same as the last two row, rows of the purple. So 
So we're just going across here. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see how many we have here now. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. We're at fourteen now on that end. Okay, so now we're just going to do our single crochet across the pumpkin, which is 21. Twenty-one single crochets and seven double crochets, and that is that is your repeat. And I will meet you at the end of this row. All right, so we ended this row with thirteen doubles and one single, and we are going to cut that off and complete row ten with the orange and yellow because we're going to be making the the nose we're going to start the nose of of the jack-o-lantern so let's start out with our orange here and we need to um start with a, a single and add another one to that and this is three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16. So now we need eight doubles of the orange. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then I don't want to finish that because I'm going to come back here and we're going to bring this yellow up here, making sure that this orange stays in front so we can work with that. Come on. So now we need five yellows. And I'm going to take this and I'm going to work with the orange down here. There's one, two, three, four, and five. Now we're not going to finish that. We're going to finish it with now we need eight orange we're just gonna let that yellow hang down there one two three four five six seven eight and then seven singles one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we had seven singles. So now here's your repeat. We need eight orange, five yellow, and eight orange, all doubles, and seven singles. And you're going to repeat that across to finish up the other three pumpkins. And I'll see you at the end. Okay, so at the end we have 15 single crochets and that's putting two in the end one. So, alright, so we just finished row 10.
now we need to we're going to do row 11 and we're going back to the purple and the purple is the same again it's the same so what we're going to do um i will get you started where we um, start with a single and then start to double See, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So we're at fifteen doubles on the end there. You're going to do twenty one singles and seven doubles. 21 singles, 7 doubles, all the way across. So I will see you at the end of row, this um, row 11, purple. Okay, so we have um, 14 doubles and 1 single there at the end. Alright, now let's finish up 11. So we'll start out with the orange. And remembering that we're going to put two in that first one. And then there's three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, come on, 16, 17. Alright, so now what we need is we need nine doubles. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Now this one we're going to go halfway so that we can bring this yellow yarn. As soon as I figure out which one is the right one, here we go. All right. And I need, we need three, but we actually, I actually need this. We need this orange yarn in front before we try to bring that yellow right put the orange in front it's a lot easier that way because then we can take the orange yarn and let it ride with us for three stitches because we need it on the other side all right so we're doing that one a half halfway a half double and then we finish the double with the orange now we need nine more double crochets with the orange. So there's two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, and then we need our seven singles here and between the pumpkins are jack-o'-lanterns two, three, four, five, six, seven. So here is, here is your, you're going to do nine um, orange doubles, three yellow doubles, and nine orange doubles, and then seven singles. And you're going to do that all the way across, and I will catch you at the end of the row. Okay, so we ended with 16 single crochets at the end. And we are done with row 11. There's row 11. All right, things start to change now for a little bit. On row 12, we're going to finish up the nose on row 12. So let's start with our purple yarn again. A standing single. And then we can start our doubles. All right, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. All right, now um, we're going to. I guess we are going to single crochet all the way across the pumpkin. So 21 single crochets. So this uh, row is the exact same as what we've been doing. We're going to do 21 single crochets across the pumpkin. And make sure we do our seven doubles on the other side of the pumpkin. So you will go 21, 7, 21 singles, 7 doubles, 21 singles, 7 doubles, all the way across. Until you get to the end. Here's our 7 doubles right here. Okay, and you'll do that all the way across, and I'll meet you at the end. Okay, so at the end, we've got 15 doubles and then one single at the end. All right, now, this is where it's going to change a little bit. We're going to finish up the nose. So let's put two singles in that first one like we've been doing. And then this is three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen singles. Okay, and now we are going to do nine doubles. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. And then we're going to bring up this. I don't know why I keep throwing that back, and I need to throw it forward, not back. <laughs> All right, here we go. So now we're just going to put one. We only need one yellow on that one, and then the rest is nine oranges, which is, there's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and now let's see, singles, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So you're going to have, um, we're going to have nine doubles, one, one double on the yellow. Okay, so nine orange, one yellow, nine orange. And then we're going to have nine singles. So you're going to go, we're going to do that all the way across to finish up that nose. And I will meet you at the end. So at the end, we have um, 18 singles at the end there. All right, that finishes up number 12. And we finished up the nose. The next two rows are going to, they're going to be exactly the same. So I'm going to go over it with you on how to do it. So let's start with our purple again. And making our double crochets. So that's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and 18. All right, now we're just going to do single crochets across here, and there'll be 19. There's 19 single crochets. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 
12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. And, and then nine doubles. You'll be doing nine doubles. So um, you're, so what that's what you're going to be doing. 19 singles and nine doubles all the way across. And I will catch you at the end. All right, so we have 17 um, double crochets at the end in that one single crochet in the last one. All right, now let's start with the orange. To finish up row. Thirteen. So we have two, we put two in the first one, there's five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, now what we're going to do is we need to put 19 double crochet across here. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, and then nine single crochets. Yeah, that's right there. There's one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Oh, wait a minute, I think I went in one too much in there. Okay, I went in the wrong one. But there is nine here. <laughs> okay, there's two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to do 19 doubles and 9 singles. And you're going to do that all the way across. Now, um, the next row, the next row with the purple will be the exact same. And with the orange will be the exact same. So, but when we come back, we will be doing row 15. So I'm going to finish row 14 and do row 15, the purple and the orange. And um, then we'll be back to do row 15. So we'll see you then. Okay, so we are done with 14. 13 and 14 and now we're going to do 15 and in 15 we're going to start the eyes 
So, we are going to start with our purple again. And this purple is exactly the same as the last time we did the purple. All right, so here we go. We've got our standing single, and now we've got one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right. Now we are um, doing um, 19 single crochets across the pumpkin. So there's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. And nine double crochets, I believe. Let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, yes, nine. So here, here is your repeat. Um, 19 um, singles and nine doubles all the way across. And I will meet you at the end. All right, so I just finished our last pumpkin, or jack-o'-lantern. Um... Let's do our doubles here. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. And so this last one will be 20, which is the single, the last single. All right, and we'll cut that off. Done with the purple. Onto the orange to finish up row 15. And this is where things start changing. So we're going to start the eyes of our jack-o'-lantern to this time. And 
And so just like normal, or like always, we are starting with a um, standing single, and we're going to put another one in there too. So there is three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, and twenty-three. So twenty-three across there. And now we need four, um, four double crochets of orange. So there's two, three, four. And then we need to find our yellow and bring it up so that we can start that. Come on. All right. And and I keep doing this wrong. Hang on a second. Oh, come on. This should be a front. Bring this up front. Now bring this yellow up. All right. And now we need three of the yellow, double crochets of the yellow. So there's two and three. Oh, but we need to bring that yellow along with us too. So we'll put it up front. And now I need three orange. One. two, and three, bring the orange up front, and now I need three more yellow, two, three, and And now we need four orange. So there's one, two, three, four. And now we need some single crochets. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And so, so here's your repeat. We need four orange doubles, three yellow doubles, three orange doubles, three yellow doubles, and four orange doubles. And then we need eleven singles. And you're going to repeat that all the way across. Okay, so I have 22 single crochets going across the end of that row. And so now we have row 15 done. And now we need to do row 16. Um... The purple part of the row is the same. All you're going to do is single is good double crochet across here and then you're going to single crochet across here and then double crochet across here and you're going to repeat that. So um, that part of the row is the same. Um, so I'm going to let you um, do the purple part 
and I will be back to do the orange part with you. Okay, so we are going to um, start the orange of of uh, row 16 now. So we have finished up row 16. There we go. And, of course, a standing single and another one in there. And we're going to go all the way across here, which, let's see, two, three, four, five, um, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So, 24. Now we need, this is the, the same as we did the last time, the exact same thing, four double crochets, and I got some more string because I had ran out. And now we need um, three, three double crochets where the, the yellow is. We're going to do three more. Come on. All right, so we're going to do three here. And I'm carrying my orange with me. carrying that tail of the yellow too, but it's going to stay back here now that I've got that buried a couple of times. Um, we need to go back to the orange. Come on. And now we need three orange. Going back to the yellow, carry the orange with me, and now we're going to do the three yellow, just like we did the last row, it's exactly the same, and then we're going to go back to the orange and finish off with four orange doubles. Okay, and then um, you're going to do singles in between the pumpkins and then continue doing that. So four double orange, three double yellow, three double orange, three double yellow, and four double orange. All right, and continue on across to the end. Okay, so we've got row 16 done. We just finished that one. And now row 17, we're going to finish off the eyes. Row 17, you're going to do the purple exactly the same way as we've been doing the last two rows. The exact same way. So I'm going to let you guys do the purple. And then I'll be back to show you how to do the orange. Okay, so now uh, since we've got the purple on, we are going to finish row 17 with the orange. 
and we're going to finish up the eyes of our jack-o'-lanterns. So we're going to do two um, singles. So there's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, and twenty-five. All right, so now we are going to put, we need five double crochets of the orange. So there is two, three, four, and five. We're going to switch over to the yellow as we're only going to put one. Oh man, hang on, I need to bring that forward and I keep doing that wrong. Yeah, that's right. All right. So we are only going to put one yellow in there. But so we're going to need to switch over to the orange. Okay, and now we need five orange. Again, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. And we need one more yellow double crochet in here. Hopefully I have enough for that. And there you go. There we go. And then we're going to end up with five. So there's one, two, three, four, five. And we need singles here. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11. Okay, so we have four singles or doubles of the orange. One double of the yellow, four doubles of the orange, one double of the yellow, and four doubles of the orange. And then 11 singles. And you're going to repeat that all the way down. Okay, so then we had 24 um, single crochets um, at the end there. So there is where what our jack-o'-lantern looks like now. And we just finished row 17. And now we need to do rows 18 and 19. Okay, 
so we're going to do the purple again and it's exactly the same you'll double crochet here you'll double crochet here and single crochet across and then double crochet in here and single crochet across so um I'll um we'll let you get to it and I will finish up my purple and then we'll come back and finish up row 18. You know what? Yeah, that's right. We'll see you then. Okay, so we've got the purple on there and now we're going to start with the orange. We're going to finish up row 18 here. Our jack-o'-lantern is just about done. That's exciting. All right. So we start with the standing single like we always do and put another one in there. And now we're just going to, here's doing singles. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, Twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, and twenty six, and twenty seven. Okay, now we need, um, we're, we need ten double crochets to go across the pumpkin. So there or jack-o'-lantern. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, it's not 10, it's 15. <laughs> Sorry. 15. 10. 11. 12. 13. 14. And 15. And now we need, these are the singles we need. There's one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen. So that is your repeat. You're going to do fifteen doubles and thirteen singles all the way across into the end and I will catch you at the end. Okay, so we ended this row with 26 single crochets at the end. All right, so that that took care of row 18. Row 19 is done the exact same way. So you will do your purple and your orange the exact same way as we did this row. Those, so we'll do purple first, then the orange. And um, just do it the exact same way as we just did row 18. Okay? And I will see you when we start row 20. Okay, so we have gotten... 18 and 19 completely finished and I did the purple of row 20 and it is exactly the same as the purple has been going the last two rows so if you don't have the purple done yet 
um, which I don't think you do, um, you may want to pause this video and do the purple before you go on to the orange with me to finish off row 20. So here we go with row 20. So we're going to do the standing single with another one. That's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. Okay, 30 single crochets. And now we need 13 doubles. So our the top of our pumpkin is shrinking a little bit more here. So there's 2, 3, 4, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So we went from fifteen to 13, which means we went in on both sides again by one. So here is the singles. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. So, here is your repeat. 13 doubles on the pumpkin, and in between the pumpkin, we've got 15 um, singles in between the jack-o'-lanterns. Pumpkins or jack-o'-lanterns? Okay, so um, I will um, catch you at the end of row 20. Okay, so we have 29 single crochets at the end there. And we just finished 20. Row 20 is finished. So then we need to do row 21, which is coming in with the, we're going to make this green, um, into the stem. So, um, first of all, though, you have to put purple on, and you're going to do your purple like you normally do, and then you're going to um, single crochet across here, just across these um 13 there's 13 there so single crochet 13 and then double crochet across here and go and do that and then we will be back uh, to do row 21 and the orange okay so now we're going to 
start row 21 and with the orange we are going to um, put two singles in the first one and here is three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty I'm like right at the end of a skein here. <laughs> oh my goodness. And it, of course it would knot up. Let's see if I could pull some more. Come on. All right, so there's 20 there. Um, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 20, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, and 32. Okay, and now what we need is four, four double crochets. On the pumpkin, there's one, two, three, four. Now half of one because now we've got this green yarn that we need to make the stem of the jack-o'-lantern. And we need three green doubles right here. So there's one two, and three. And then we we don't want to finish that one because we got to go back to this orange. Put everything back there. And now we need four orange on the other side. So we need to put two more orange right here, and then we need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen singles. So, and that will be your repeat. Okay, your repeat is four orange, three green, four orange and 17 singles and you do that all the way across and I will see you at the end of this row alright so we ended that row with 31 singles alright we need 
we just finished row 21. Now we have two more rows to do. And we have two more rows to do without the orange. We are done with the orange right now. So we are um, going to need our purple. And of course we have the greens all connected. Let me go get that purple yarn. I left it over here. All right. But good news is we are just about done. All right. So we are starting the purple like we normally do. double crochet over to the jack-o-lantern. I think that's about 31 or 32 stitches. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, four, fifty, six, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty, three, four, five, six, seven, twenty, eight, twenty nine, thirty. Yeah, thirty one. You got your single crochet and thirty one double crochets, and now we are just going to single crochet across the pumpkins or the jack o' lanterns, which is um, 13 should be 11 so let's make sure there's two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven and then we need to double crochet. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, seventeen in between. So there is your you're going to single crochet 11, double crochet 17 in between the jack-o'-lanterns. 
and we'll do that all the way across and I will catch you at the end of this row. All right, so at the end of this row, we have 30 double crochets and one single at the end. Now, we are still doing purple because we are all done with the orange. And this will finish off row 22. And we're going to do a little bit more of the <clears throat> stem as we do this. So, so pretend this is orange. And because we're doing an orange row, we need to put two single crochets in that first one. And then we're going to single crochet all the way down to the jack-o'-lantern. And now that should be 34 stitches. Thirty-four single crochets down. Okay, and then we're just going to, um, we're going to double crochet here. So we need four double crochets. And then we're going to bring in the green. Wait a minute, was it four? No, it's three. So, sorry about that, that's three, we're doing it half, we need four green, so there's one, two, three, four. What happened? Okay, hang on a second. I don't know what happened. All right. Goodness gracious. We need three. Bring the purple forward because we need to put this green in here. Where is it? There it is. And now we need four. All right, there's one, two. We're carrying this purple over. Three, four, and then we're going to put this green over here, and there we go. Now we need to continue the purple, which is four. It looks like we got four on this side. Double crochets, and now you're going to single crochet in the 17 in between. And you're going to do that all the way down. So you need three double crochets and four green double crochets and then four purple double crochets. And then um, we're going to single crochet in the 17. Okay? And you'll do that all the way down. 
Okay, so we have um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 32. So we have 32 single crochets at the end there, and we're going to cut that off. Okay, and that ends row 22. So row 22 is finished. Um, now we need to do row 33, and we're going to go with the purple. And also, at the end of this row, um, we were supposed to put two um, double crochets in that last, or single crochets in that last one. All right, so here is the purple row. And since we are still on purple, we're still going to be adding um, two single crochets at each end. Because all we're trying to do is to finish the green. And I think, I think we can finish that. I think we finished that on this row, maybe. No, I think I tried that once and it didn't work. So we've got to pretend that this is all single crochets here. It is all single crochets. We're going to single crochet. You're, what you're going to do is you're going to single crochet purple all the way across the blanket. <laughs> or the blanket. The, um, the shawl. So... You're just going to do single crochet. Just remember that you are putting two uh, single crochets on the two end ones. So, and then we'll be back to finish the stem um, in the next row. All right. So, now let's finish up um, the stem of our jack-o-lantern and this is the last row of of this part of the shawl all right so again we are working in back loops only and doing single crochets and we need two in that first one and we're on a single crochet all the way over um, to where we need to All right, so we want to bring the green up through this one. And we need we need four 
double crochets. One, two, three, wait a minute, not on those. <laughs> we got to go two rows below. Oh my goodness, which is this one. So here's one, two, three, four, and then we'll bring back the purple. And then we're going to cut off, cut off that green. And um, we're just going to continue on single crocheting in the back loops until you get to the next one. So you'll single crochet all the way across here to the back loop until you get to this one and it's this one right here. This one the starts here. One, two, three, four with your your green and then you just continue on single crocheting around uh, across and make sure that at the end you're putting two single crochets in that last stitch and I will see you at the end of this row okay so that finishes up the last row of the jack-o'-lanterns so now going again with the purple we're going to finish this up. Um, just like we've been doing. Two single crochets at each end. And then just, we need four rows. And what you'll do, just like we did, um, you won't cut it off at each end anymore for for four rows so you'll go all the way across you'll chain one turn come back chain one turn come back chain one turn come back for the last time and um, and then we'll be red you'll be ready um, to do the black cats um, next week so, um, I hope you guys are enjoying this. I know these videos are long, um, but, you know, I hope, I hope you're really enjoying this and hoping you guys are making this too along with me. I really in, loved, um, coming up with this shawl and, um, I think it's a really neat shawl. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Have a great day and bye-bye now.